the sands of time run to another one of the circuits in Arabia as Jeddah awaits our drivers today in the Formula 1 Saudi Arabian Grand Prix. Well, here we are then. West on the left, Hamilton to the right. As we go to five red lights. Lights out, away we go in Jeddah. West gets an okay start. Hamilton maybe looking down to his inside into turn one. Hamilton diving in the in, in clipping the apex. Great move from Lewis Hamilton. He sails around the outside of West in turn one. And looking now at Verstappen, who looking to chase down on West after the poor start. Leclerc's going to look to the inside going into turn four. Contact and Verstappen might be out. And he also made contact with Perez. The two Red Bulls damaged. But Leclerc will hold on to, holds on to third place. So close. But Verstappen's out. Surely after that incident. But very, very lucky for Leclerc to keep going. But Hamilton and West lead the way. Going into the hairpin now. Hamilton holding out and will make that very nice take. Well, here's the replay. I don't know if Verstappen just didn't see him. Leclerc made a very late move. And, well, it's just... Last of the late breakers. And well, oh yeah, that was a huge whack on Perez. And well, now we have Kai Howell right on the back of a damaged Sergio Perez. Can she make the difference? Especially after her podium last time out in Bahrain. What's she going to do here? Howell in the slipstream, DRS open. Moving towards the inside as Kai Howell looks down the inside of Sergio Perez and Perez slams the door. Not quite enough for Kai Howell. Here we are then, Carlos Sainz looking down the inside of Sebastian Vettel and just pinched by the German, the four-time world champion. But Sainz will now have the run, going down into turn four. What's going to happen here? Carlos Sainz lunging down the inside and hitting Sebastian Vettel his round. Sebastian Vettel not in the best of days today. And well. George Russell now on the back of Elliot West going down towards turn one. DRS open from both drivers. Lewis, ha Lewis Hamilton striding off into the distance with George Russell and West side by side in this contact. West moves across. George Russell had a bit of a con had to move out of the way, but he gets second place down into turn one. Fortune favours the bold. And well, Esteban Ocon has, Ocon has made a fantastic first 16 laps here in uh, Jeddah right on the back of Jed Jensen Button he loves his circuit third nearly in 2021 starting on pole in the restart and Ocon down the inside of Jensen Button Button pinches and Button almost losing out to Esteban Ocon but holding out nicely well West coming out the pit small contact with the wall but Lewis Hamilton will keep first place but now West will be right on his tail going down towards turn four and potentially the DRS zone right before the hairpin but West trying to get the tyres up to temperature and Lewis Hamilton will be feeling under pressure from West as he comes now through the sweeping right hander through the sweeping left hander and onto the straight now before the hairpin Elliot West right on the back of Lewis Hamilton now and will maybe look to the inside West so nip and suck from the two Brits. Here we are, through the and brilliantly held out by Lewis Hamilton. West couldn't get round there, but it was so so close, so tight, and the two Brits kept it clean and fair. But West now will have to put the pressure on Lewis Hamilton to force him into a mistake. Well then, West has sort of dropped off the past few laps. But oh, he's round! West has spins round, lost traction off the corner. The Leclerc and Perez are through, but West will have to try and make that ground back up. And now he's under pressure with Mick Schumacher and Gasly from behind. Mick Schumacher has been in absolutely brilliant form so far today. But this is not looking good for West. He's all over the place, damage everywhere. And well, I don't think it will need a safety car. Well, Hamilton is falling behind, a slow stop for the Mercedes crew, letting Leclerc and Perez through. Well, the Mercedes powered teams have not had good fortune today at all. Especially West Racing Sport, the feeder junior team of Mercedes, rival to Alpha Tauri, and they've done brilliantly so far, but West will be right on Hamilton's tail, now going for the latter part of the race. Well, West now, right on the back of Lewis Hamilton. 
This is where him and Hamilton and Verstappen clashed in 2021. West will look to the inside. Hamilton keeping holding the outside, maybe. But this is so tight and it's so, so close. Hamilton holds the outside once more. But West will have the DRS going down into turn one. And he will pull to the right hand side. West might have the dominant line going into turn one. Will he triumph last of the late breakers? And West keeps it round the outside and holds the position. He's up to third on lap 36, now hunting down Perez and Leclerc. Hamilton might have another go back into turn four, but I think he holds out. Well, West has caught up to Perez extremely quickly. Leclerc's built out a gap to Perez as well, so he's out of DRS range. But Perez will be now under pressure, going into t the hairpin now. West pulls to the inside, looking inside now. And Perez will try and hold out. Contact between the two of them. And that is so brave from Sergio Perez, the master of defence. The Mexican master is absolutely held out West. And well, this is so, so close and so tight. But now West will have to put the pressure on as they're down for another DRS zone all the way along the Red Sea. This is going to be very exciting as we come down into the one of the tightest corners of the track. And oh wow, West! Oh, he goes wide. He's going to have to get that back. West will surely have to get that back to Sergio Perez, and I think he's going to slow down the straight. This is well, Shader 2021, a Mercedes-powered car and a Red Bull. Well, West. Did he give the position back there? I believe he has. He's trying to accelerate again to hold the outside. And well, Perez will hold the inside and will get the position back. But now West will have the DRS as he comes down towards turn one. Exhilarating stuff from West and Perez. West will have the outside. It's going to be last of the late breakers again. Almost a, a shadow of what Hamilton and West had just ten laps ago. But now West gets the inside and he's beaten Sergio Perez. And now he chases down Charles Leclerc in the Ferrari. Esteban Ocon now, chasing down Lewis Hamilton, he's had a brilliant Grand Prix, the Frenchman in the Alpine, what a result it could be if he could try and get a podium today, the pace has been with the Pink Panthers, it's been absolutely incredible from the Frenchman as well, Ocon looks to the inside on the seven time world champion Lewis Hamilton and he might just get the door to move done, he's trying to hold the outside contact between the two of them and Lewis Hamilton loses out but Ocon wins the battle. And now he hunts down Sergio Perez. One last lap then for Charles Leclerc to potentially hold on. West has been catching and catching and catching. He's got using all the available road. The final corner and the DRS zone awaits for West and Leclerc. But Leclerc trying to hold out. West will maybe look to the inside here. And maybe it's going to be a drag race to the line. But Leclerc is going to try and hold out. And West spins round. It's all over. Leclerc's going to win the Grand Prix. But West, that's an awful throwaway of a victory, potentially for him. But Charles Leclerc in the Ferrari is a winner again. And wow, 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 wow. Perez in second. Ocon takes third. Hamilton in fourth. And West throwing away points in fifth. Well, well, well. What a race that was. Well, Ocon with the podium. Leclerc with the win. Perez with the podium as well. But a shock here in Jeddah tonight with West. Also, Jamie Chadwick receiving points on her debut. But Max Verstappen still leading the championship despite his retirement. We go on to Turkey.